While most were sleeping or preparing for Christmas celebrations, Chicago police were investigating a gruesome crime. A man decapitated, his body pulled from a basement apartment. CBS 2's Courtsme Guzman spent the day in the city's Hermosa neighborhood to get more answers. It's here in the 2500 block of North Kildare where you'll find this basement apartment sealed up. A crime scene where the medical examiner's office says 41-year-old Sylvester Diaz Hernandez was murdered, his head severed, discovered during the wee hours of Christmas morning. Well, I got the feeling something went really wrong because mm -hmm. the paramedics going inside and coming back empty-handed. Nahu Acuna just wrapped a family Christmas Eve party shortly before 2 in the morning when he heard and saw a large police presence. We just see the, you know, like the the figure of the boy, you know, being arrested and put him in the squad car. Police now identifying that 18 year old as Alexis Valdez. He's charged with first degree murder. Officers say they also found the knife used in the attack. So you're saying police were here that night, earlier that night before all of this happened? Before all this happened, yeah, they were four times. They've been called four times, like disturbing, you know, disturbing call from that house. Detectives and I cross paths as they continue to question some of the neighbors I talked to. Most people shocked by the timing of this crime. My wife says it, it's hard to believe like people do like that on Christmas, you know. Police have yet to say how Valdez knew his alleged victim or why this crime was committed. But what we do know is that that victim lived in that basement apartment. Live in the newsroom, Courtney Guzman, CBS 2 News. Derek and Dana. Courtney, thank you.